Project Hero will be conducting a search of the Henrietta Muir Edwards Park uh, between May 9th and May 11th. Uh, Project Hero is continuing their investigation into high risk missing persons and information has been received by care investigators to indicate that the park may have potential evidence in relation to an ongoing Project Care investigation. A planned and coordinated search will be conducted in the area starting today and uh, anticipated will be completed by Wednesday evening. As a result, a portion of this park will be shut down to the public uh, as the police conduct the search. The search is very diverse. It's in a treed area and it will take a period of time to search the park properly. Uh, it will vary depending on uh, certain factors such as weather, uh, terrain, and what type of items are located in the search. Some of the uh, resources that are uh, involved in the search include the Forensic Identification Unit, uh, search dogs from the Canadian uh, Search Dog Association, members of the RCMP and the Special Tactical Operation uh, Unit, Edmonton Police uh, Services Officers, and of course uh, investigators of Project CARE. Uh, police are not disclosing uh, the items being searched as there is a need to protect uh, the ongoing and active uh, Project CARE investigation. Well, information has been obtained and uh, it has pointed us in the direction uh, of this park. We go where the evidence leads us. So the information has been obtained and it's prudent for us to conduct this planned search. From the Edmonton Queen, along the pathway, and the pathway is shut down, that runs uh, east and west. It goes along this pathway along the tree line, around the uh, external trailer of the Edmonton Queen, along the trail line. This is where our parking lot is right now. And then along 98th A Avenue North to uh, 96 A Street. It goes around this parking lot and then to the river. That's our search area, it's been cordoned off and we ask that the public respect that uh, perimeter that's been set up.